In this video, we will be starting with your Indian Economic Development, which is your first book of class 11th. Now, the first chapter in your first book or the first topic in your first unit is Indian Economy, economy on the Eve of Independence. See, we all know that British ruled us and we got independence in 1947. So what was the condition of our Indian economy during 1947? Let's see this. Now there are various questions that arises. What was our economy backward at that time? Was our economy developing or vibrant? or stagnant so we have this question that was our economy a backward economy developing economy vibrant economy or stagnant economy let's understand the difference between all these economies see backward economy it is character uh, characterized by the predominance of farming as a source of subsistence it is driven more by the subsistence motive rather than the motive of profit maximization. Quality of life is extremely low and absolute poverty is widespread. So, there is a predominance of farming in this economy. See, profit maximization is not the main objective what is the ex uh, objective is your subsistence your living then there was a extremely low and absolute poverty in the backward economy then comes your developing economy it is more like a backward economy in terms of quality of life and predominance of absolute poverty but at the same time it is an economy where change is evident in terms of the rising levels of per capita income and in terms of transformation from agriculture sector to industrial sector as a source of livelihood now what is going in the developing economy see again there is a predominance of absolute poverty and poor quality of life. After that, what happens? You try to change your economy in terms of rising levels of per capita income. And in this economy, what you do? You shift from agriculture sector to industrial sector as a source of livelihood to live you have now not only relied on the agriculture in this economy you have shifted to the industrial sector now there comes the vibrant economy a vibrant economy it is characterized by dynamic changes in terms of the emerging role of technology in the process of production. that in the process of production what you are doing you are 
taking technology as a more you are taking technology into consideration to do well so production is more market oriented and profit motive because an important parameter of production decision so here what you do you have transformed your economy from the subsistence to the profit making level so production is more market oriented and profit motive then comes your stagnant economy your stagnant economy is an economy which is characterized by a prolonged period of slow economic growth there is a slow economic growth in the stagnant economy now in order to understand which is our which was our indian economy on the eve of independence we will be studying the various sectors of india from which we can earn from which we earn something and that makes our economy so let's see this the points indicating state of the indian economy on the eve of independence now what we will do we will study the various sectors the, uh, that what was the condition of the sectors at the time of the independence and we will analyze the condition of the indian economy during the, uh, that period so the state of agriculture sector how was the agriculture sector during independence then comes your demographic profile of the country how much was the infant mortality rate what was the birth rate death rate and everything then come the state of industrial sector how was the industry at that point of time then we will study the occupational sector what were the occupations that people were into then we have to study the state of india's foreign trade what was the condition of the foreign trade at the time of british rule or on the eve of independence then comes your economic and social infrastructure now what was the economic and social infrastructure were the uh, we used to use the roadways railways or airways or what was the economic infrastructure and the social infrastructure so this is very brief video about what we will study in the indian economy on the eve of independence so we will be studying the each individual topic in the coming videos i hope you like our video please download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us